Sweden to deliver Ukraine eight wheeled 155mm Archer howitzers. Sweden will transfer eight Archer self-propelled artillery mounts to Ukraine as part of the military aid package, which the country announced back in January. Dagen's industry outlet writes about it. Thus, on March the 16th, the Swedish government submitted to Parliament a draft amendment to the budget which refers to the provision of Ukraine with eight Archer artillery mounts as well as ten Leopard tanks. The German publication De Spiegel wrote at the end of February that Sweden wants to transfer a total of ten Leopard 2A6 and 2A5 tanks to Ukraine. But this was officially announced only on March the 15th. A total of eight artillery mounts and ten tanks are estimated at just over six billion crowns, more than 500 million US dollars. This is money that the Swedish armed forces should receive during 2024 to 2026 to replace what is now needed to be sent to Ukraine. However, it will be several months before Ukraine can start using Archer in the field. It is necessary to install computers for fire control, train the Ukrainian military and create a logistics hub near Ukraine for maintenance and repair, the newspaper writes. It is estimated that Ukraine will be able to use six of the eight artillery mounts on the battlefield, since two need to be kept in reserve in order to be able, for example, to pick up spare parts. The artillery installations will give the Ukrainians the opportunity to knock out Russian artillery systems, said Swedish Defense Minister Paul Johnson. The Archer is a 155mm self-propelled artillery mount with a 55 caliber FH-77B cannon. The maximum firing range of this installation is 30 km, with a conventional projectile 40 km, with an active rocket projectile and 60 km with an Excalibur guided projectile. It should be noted that on January the 19th, Sweden announced a new package of military assistance to Ukraine. It included 50 CV-90 infantry fighting vehicles, 57 NLAW anti-tank systems and 155mm Archer self-propelled artillery mounts.